Hello everyone, welcome back to Hearthstone. Alright, time for a new arena run. I'm hoping for a rogue. I think it's my favorite class to play in arena. Actually, I think it's just my favorite class to play straight up. <sighs> Great. Okay. A hunter seems to be... From what I've heard, it's one of the worst in arenas, just because it's really hard to get the right cards to make it work. Warlock. I don't know. I mean, last time I tried to play Warlock in Arena, which I believe was only once, I got 2-3. Shaman has Overload, which... I honestly, I honestly I don't... Ow. Fucking hell, my hand. Ah! Damn it. That's what I get for stretching my arm. Anyway, what was I saying? Oh yes, they have Overload, which I really don't know how to play with. I'm gonna go with Warlock, what the hell? Let's see what happens. It'll be fu- whoa. <laughs> it's one hell of a first selection. Hmm. Alright, King Mukla, no. It's, it's gonna be either Black Knight or Tink Master Overspark. The Black Knight can be extraordinarily good. You can destroy the biggest damn taunt for free. And you still get something big on the board. On the other hand, Tink Master Overspark can be very useful as well. Can either take it down a huge enemy minion, or at least has a chance of taking it down, or can potentially buff up one of your very weak things. But... Hmm. I'm gonna go with the Black Knight. I really want to play with it, it just seems like a fun card. And this is a terrible selection. Wisp, absolutely not. Oasis Snapjaw. By the way, I'm not even really familiar with what cards Warlocks have. So I really don't know what I could, like, combine with the Oasis Snapjaw to do something with it. I don't know. Raid Leader? Eh. Raid Leader or Oasis Snapjaw? Neither are very good. This thing does have a lot of health. And with two damage, it could potentially take out weak stuff. But... Hmm. I don't know. Raid leader? I'll go with raid leader. Hmm. All of these are good. Amani Berserker's damn good. Power Overwhelming can be very nice. Can trade up. Yeah, I can take a really weak minion and take out something really big with it. Mortal Coil's nice, you can use it to pick off enemies and draw a card. Yeah, it's going to be either Mortal Coil or Amani Berserker. Let's go with Mortal Coil. Oh gee, you're getting all the cards you need. Must be nice. Wait, what? I have no idea who you're referring to. That's my usual reaction in Arena. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It does seem that way, doesn't it? Like, that's a great card for you to have. I wish I had something like that. Ah. <sighs> Injured Blade Master, hell no. Gatchis on Auctioneer or Defender of Vargas. Both are very good. I'm probably going to be casting a lot of spells, assuming I get them. Let's 
Uh, you know, then again, do I really need card draw? I'm a warlock, do I really need card draw? I guess I probably really don't, do I? Let's go with the Defender of Argus. Ooh, it's pretty easy. Flame Imp, absolutely. Hmm. Hellfire. Alright, if you can get Summoning Portal to stick, it can be extremely valuable. It can allow you to just flood the board with a massive stuff. Or at least a massive amount of stuff, at least. The problem is, actually getting it to stick is very difficult. I'm gonna go with Hellfire. Hmm. Let's go Soulfire. Blood Imp. Excellent card. Again, I guess I probably don't need... Card draw, really. I don't have weapons, so let's go with Acidic Swamp Boost. <laughs> Blood Sail Corsair, hell no. Archie Commander and Ravenhold Assassin are both good. Let's go with Archie Commander. Harvest Gold. Hmm. I'm getting a lot of spells, but I need actual minions, but let's go Shadow Bolt. Fear my 1-1 one, one Silverhand Recruit. Fear it. Ooh, fear my Goldshire Footman. No way, I'm not taking that. Um. Hmm. Bloodfin Raptor or Murloc Tidehunter? See, the more smaller things I have, the more things I could combo with Raid Leader. But is that the only thing I could really combo at the moment? With having, you know, more than one minion come out of a card? Because this is essentially the same stats. No, it's literally the same stats as the Bloodfan Hunt Raptor. When you combine it. 3-2. The only difference being there's two of them. I could also combo with Defender of Argus. Yeah, let's go with it. Ooh. I'm getting some pretty good stuff here for early pressure. I've got two Flame Imps. And a Blood Imp. And a decent amount, a pretty good amount of spells of removal. Hmm. Do I want another Hellfire? Not really. Alright, so this is the same as the Iron for a Grizzly, essentially, except that it has Enrage and one less attack. Let's go the Torn Warrior. Could use some more two-costers. On the other hand, if I'm going to be getting a lot of very small stuff out, such as the Blood Imp, the Flame Imp, and the Murdoch Tide Tidehunter stuff, uh, the split damage would not necessarily be good. Hmm. On the other hand, more two-costers would be nice. I don't know. I mean, I could go with the Mogishan Warden to potentially protect my Flame Imps and... Well, I guess that's pretty much it. Because these things are really low cost, but they deal damage to you. So if you can make them stick, you know, stay around for a little while, they can get some really crazy early pressure out. And I could potentially maintain that pressure with Mogishan Warden. On the other hand, Ventrico Mercenary allows me to continue pressuring, and I have quite a bit of spells to remove stuff from the board. Which means even with the increase in minion cost, I might be able to still, you know, just snipe stuff, snipe stuff off the board and just don't worry about the minions too much. You know, don't worry about the cost. Hmm. They all seem like valid options to me. What 
Which one's more valuable? I don't know. I'm really iffy about Mad Bomber when I have a Blood Imp around. So I'm going to say no to that. Hmm. Let's go to Ventrico. Yeah, I'm really not sure if I want another Hellfire. On the other hand, I could use it to keep stuff off the board and get some of my later game... Fairly powerful stuff out. Hmm, I don't know. I'm not used to playing Warlock. Especially not Warlock in Arena. Let's go with the Dark Iron, should I? Yeah. It'll be fine. Ooh, Succubus. Everything else kind of sucks, so yeah, let's go with that. <laughs> Sacrificial Pact. Yeah. Destroy... A demon restore five health to your hero. Mm. That doesn't seem very good. I don't really want any of these cards, particularly. I guess I'll go with the Frost Wolf. Siphon Soul. Hmm. I mean, I guess it's kind of like an Assassinate, isn't it? Except it also heals you. I could take down even the biggest of things. Hmm. Or I could go with the Young Priestess. Let's go to Siphon Soul. Alright, I need some lower cost minions. Well, alright, let me look at how much removal I have. I have a Soul Fire, Mortal Coil, Shadow Bolt, Hellfire, and a Siphon Soul. It's a pretty good amount. Demon Fire seems like relatively weak removal. Could also use it as a buff, of course, on a friendly demon. But... Hmm, let's go to Raging Organ. Let's go to another Succubus. Ooh, Sense Demons. Or a Blood Imp. Hmm... I mean, this would get me lots of succubi, and flame imps, and blood imp. My first win! Thing is, I, again, warlocks don't exactly want for card draw. But this would guarantee a specific kind of card draw. My demons, which would allow earlier pressure. On the other hand, Blood Imp is great, so that could kind of be awesome too. Which one's more valuable? Hmm. I'm not sure, I'm gonna go with the Blood Imp. I really want some lower costers. It's looking like I've got a... I've got a lot of bigger stuff, which means I might need to just survive the early game and just weather the storm with Hellfire and whatnot. Right, I already have a Black Knight and an Argent Commander. I only have two five costers. Let's... Dread Infernal's good. It can wipe a bunch of small stuff from the board. Storm Pike Commando. Storm Pike Commando can easily two for one. Let's go with that. Void Walker, excellent taunt. 
I guess I'm going to Demon Fire. Let's see, at the moment I have no silence. I really need some lower costers. I mean, I've got a bunch of one costers. Which I guess kind of counts. Now I'm starting to think maybe I should have gone for the sense demons. I don't know. I'm thinking silence, though. I don't know. The frost elemental could frost elemental could buy me time. Spellbreaker's lower cost. Let's go the lower cost. <laughs> Do I want even more removal? Or lower cost minion. One, two, three, four. I already have four three costers, which is not great, but it's not bad. Hmm. You know, I've only got three more cards. I think I should just accept the fact that I'm not going to have a lot of, like, two costers. I've got a lot of one costers, but... I don't know. I mean, I've got a good amount of this early pressure. I don't have a lot of, like... I don't have as much 2 and 3 cost as I'd like, but some of the 1 cost makes up for the lack of 2 cost. Maybe I should just get more removal and just weather the storm, so to speak. I mean, it seems like that's where my deck has gone. Let's go with that. Just try to get to the later game where I can start putting on some really big stuff. More, yet more spells. Shadow Flame would be a very powerful AoE. Thing is, though, you're two for one Or. Well, no, actually, that doesn't necessarily make sense. You're. Well, you're destroying a minion. And you're using a card. So, unless you're destroying a lot of the enemy, it's not really worth it. There'd have to be a lot on the board for that to be worth it. And for the same cost, I have a Hellfire. Of course, it only does three damage, whereas this can do as much damage as one of your minions' attack is, plus this deals it to all characters, this is only to the enemy. So, hmm. I don't know. I feel like Siphon Soul is going to be better. <laughs> Two Siphon Souls. Whoa! <gasps> What the hell kind of a deck am I getting? What? This is really bizarre. This might be the best deck ever. And I'm just going to play it into the ground because I don't know how to play Warlock or what the hell I'm doing. Or maybe it's just utterly horrible but amusing. I'm not sure, but this is weird. Okay. Um. Well, Leroy allows me to... Like, am I going to be a one-turn kill Warlock? Do I have that? Is, is that what I am? How much direct damage can I do to them? Hellfire, that's pretty poor. Shadow Bolt's only to a minion. Yeah, this is only to a minion. Minion. Soulfire's not to a minion, okay. I don't know if Leroy's a good idea. Maybe Anixia? The beast is earlier pressure. But again, when it dies, it does summon something. But I could potentially silence my own beast to get rid of the negative death rattle, which would be pretty amusing. Hmm. Huh. I'm thinking maybe the beast. Then again, I don't have any six, uh, anything above six costing. But I'm thinking like early pressure might kind of be my thing. And getting this out on around like turn six is pretty damn powerful. Of course, I might just get Paul lead or something, but 
That's the same for any minion. Hmm. Anixia or the Beast? I really don't know. I'm gonna go with the Beast. All right. I mean, what? What am I? Like, I don't know how to play Warlock, and I've just gotten the strangest cards. I don't know what the hell. If I have to suffer, then so do you. <laughs> well, I don't know if I'm going to suffer. I'm confused and intrigued by what the hell this deck is going to do. What have I built? What, what do I do with this? Alright, so I get my early stuff out. My Blood Imps, my Flame Imps, my Void Walker. And then I guess I just use my spells to try to keep everything they have off the board. I mean, I've got, I've got Succubi. Imps, void walkers, lots of low cost, high damage stuff. I have the beast, low cost, high damage. I'm thinking this deck is either amazing or it's incredibly terrible. And I don't even know how to tell. Let's find out! I won at least one game! Joy! Yeah! Gul'dan versus Gul'dan! Your soul shall be mine! Another warlock. Your soul shall suffer! <laughs> no, no, and no. Let's try that again. One costers, one costers, one costers. Yes, yes. Uh. All right. I greet you. I'll just back that up with an Argent Commander next turn, and everybody's good. Right. So I'm not going to save my stuff. If they put stuff on the board, I'm probably going to remove it if I can. What have you got? You get a coin. Can I coin it? Ah! Right, so you spent a card on that. I'm gonna spend a card on Demon Fire, but you're gonna be hurt. Which puts me in the lead. Next turn, I can Raid Leader and attack with my Imp. How about no? Ooh. Please give me a removal. Please, 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 please. Right. I'm not playing that. Oh, Black Knight, hi. How you doing, Black Knight? Have you had a good day so far? Must cleanse the sun well. <clears throat> oh, I've got my own succubus. Okay. Is that the best play? Hmm, maybe. It wouldn't die. It wouldn't die to the Shattered Sun Cleric. And it would kill the their succubus. This is the same way. Let's life tap now. The oh my god. Bye, Dark Iron.
Got a lot of big things, but it doesn't matter if I die before I can play them. Next turn I can store by Commando to take out something small. Do you have removal? Mm-hmm. I have some too, somewhere. Hopefully right about now before I die. Oh, that was wonderful. Yeah, great. Okay, great. Right, I need to get damage off the board before I die. I'm in emergency mode at this point. I wonder. I've got a huge guy. Right, they have five damage to my face that they can do. But at least I can kill their succubus next turn. Man, where's all my removal? I'm thinking maybe I should have gone for Sense Demons. Oh my god. The damage. The damage. My face. My beautiful face. Okay. The question here is not how do I do this or that, but it's really it's just how do I not die? Hmm. Hmm. Right, kill that. I can use my Argent Commander to kill that. Is that the best thing? Probably. I'm ready. Victory if they have a demon fire, they can do six damage to me at the moment. Or whatever that card's called that does four damage and discards a random card and costs zero. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What is that? Oh, do you have a demon thing? Do you have a demon thing? Oh, you don't. Okay. Ooh. Ah. I get myself down to one hit point. Wonderful. Where's my... Where's my... Where's my stuff? Damn it. I think I'm just dead here. Hmm. Well, actually, wait a minute. Hold on. Hold <laughs> no, I'm apparently not dead. Five. <laughs> I can put myself at one hit point. So many possibilities. All right. Victory. Right. I'm gonna need a miracle to get my way out of this one. Please have no direct damage. <laughs> I'm at one hit point. Oh boy. Better yet, why don't you play a huge taunt? Come on, come on. You know you want to. Something big and scary. I'm a black knight, I'm a black knight. Alright. So no direct damage, unless there's the Dread Infernal, but you can't play that on four mana. That's assuming they even have another one. They've already played one. What's the chance of two Dread Infernals? Not that high, really. Hmm. Well, eliminate everything the enemy has on the board. Worked for one turn.
Again, I don't know if this is a good deck or a bad deck. I don't know if it's a great deck and I'm playing it horribly because I don't know how to play Warlock because I don't. I most certainly do not. I've barely played this them. This is fun to play, though. Some fun stuff in here. Gul'dan versus Anduin. The light shall bring victory. Your soul shall be mine. Ooh. Blood Imp Voidwalker on turn one. Or I could Acidic Swamp Ooze with my co- Oh, hello. In that case, I think I'll definitely blood him Voidwalker. Have fun with that. Now, do I just Succubus next turn? I don't know, it depends on what cards I get next turn. Like, I'm not too worried about losing Siphon Soul. <laughs> it's time for a little blood. Black Knight. What a wonderful time to show up. Alright, that thing's gonna become quickly enraged. Hmm. I feel like I'm going to suicide whatever I put on the board. So I might as well suicide without wasting a card? It depends on whether I get removal next turn. That I can actually play. Because this thing's going to become enraged and I'm going to need to deal with it. As much as I don't like it, I'm thinking I, I should sacrifice the Blood Imp. Black Knight, no! Alright, what have you got? I must consider. What is that? One shot, one. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> Another thing I can't play.
Well, we're kind of on even terms at this point. About the same health, about the same board presence, about the same number of cards. Ooh, I wish I had a Hellfire right about now. Hmm. Let's absorb everything they have on the board. Do I really want to discard cards? With the succubus? I don't know if I do. Now nah, let's do it. Goodbye, Siphon Soul. They certainly have a card advantage. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. I don't know. I could have Storm Pike commanded that, and then they could have run their Murloc Scout into it, leaving it at one health. I wonder. I don't know. I mean, maybe just by delaying so long, I put myself in a good situation because I'm going to be able to start playing big stuff, which is I seem to have quite a bit of. Of course, I lost two six-costers with my succubi. Alright, board reset. Okay. Hmm. Do I storm pie commando or do I tap? Let's tap. Guess I won't silence anything. Squire, attend me. Ready, sir. Hmm. I could demon fire that and attack that, leaving me with. Well, I could do that. Orchid, Storm Pie Commando, kill that, trade that out, leave my Storm Pie Commando on the board, put out the Flame Imp. So many possibilities. I don't want to leave them anything on the board to buff. I really don't. Oh, it's my own succubus and my own soul fire that just disappeared, thankfully. Hmm. Could buff up this thing into a beast. Another Shadow Bolt. Four, five, six, seven. Do I want to trade out here? I wonder. Hmm. 
Why did I buff that up if it's just gonna die? No, I didn't play that right. I did not play that right. Not at all. Right, now everything's reset again, but I'm at half health. Meet my mighty Frostwolf, 4445, four, four, ultimate value. What the hell could I have done there? I Oh wow, no plays, okay. I could have shadow bolted the thing on the right, shadow bolted the thing on the left, sacrificed one thing. Would have anything I ha would anything I had survived? I don't think so. I'm pretty sure everything would have traded out. One shot. Ooh, good play. Good, good play. And that's gonna die when I hit that. Alright, yeah. Invest as much as you want in that card. It's still gonna die. Alright, see what card I get. Ooh. That's just Siphon Soul. Well, this game's turned in my favor. Well, I'm certainly not going to play this now. Um, do I have lethal? Eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. I have 14 damage. 15, 16, 17. Hmm. Do I keep my Raging Worgen, or do I just play it? Let's life down. I don't believe there's any direct damage they could do to me that could do 12 damage. Hmm. That's inconvenient. Two damage to all characters, correct? I probably have lethal here. Maybe. Let's see. Let's let's see. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. I think I've made a very mean druid deck. Cool. So many possibilities. Kill that. That dies, unfortunately. It leaves me with four damage. Hmm. Four damage. Eight. Four, five, six, seven. Hmm. Ventrico. Interesting. Wait, 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 do I have lethal? Is this lethal? I'm not sure. Oh, it is lethal. Oh, okay. I did have lethal. Oh, that was one hell of a game. Still don't know what the hell I'm doing.
Gul'dan versus Anduin. The light shall bring victory. Your soul shall be mine. Hmm. Do I want both of these? Maybe? Um, I'll keep them. Well, I don't lack for removal, that's for sure. I greet you. Is someone injured? Greetings. Hmm. I can't kill that thing, can I? Hmm. All right. So many possibilities. If I play this, we're probably just going to heal it back up. And get a card out of it. Kill that, heal it back up, get a card out of it. I wonder. I'm going to wait until turn two, and I'm probably going to Shadow Bolt it. It doesn't work like that. Where did the music go? Like, the game is completely silent. That's very, very strange. It's like everybody's holding their breath. Where did they go? There. I'll fill up the board with some sounds. No plays on turn three. Okay. Demon Fire and Sacrifice My Raging Worgen. I can Mortal Coil my own Worgen to kill it. But that's two for one -ing. Hmm. Do I want to do that? Don't know if I want to, but I just did. Next turn I could raid leader. Get some extra damage here. Put a copy of a random minion from your opponent's deck into the battlefield. Oh god, what are you gonna get? Oh, that's okay. I was worried to be like the beast or something. Smack that into that, mortal coil it, leaves me with four mana. This is a really slow game. We're not even hitting each other, we're just smacking... Just smacking each other's minions. 
Hmm. Right, so this is obviously going to die, there's no doubt about that. Smack to the face. Where did the music go? I mean, it's it's on. Put it on your head. Ooh. Nice play. Although now I could just kill that. Or not. Actually, I can I can still kill it. Shadow bolt plus that. Or I could just siphon I could just siphon soul. And flame imp. Wow, there's a lot of things I could do here. Actually, I could Siphon Soul, I could Spell Break It, then hit it. Four, five, six, seven. Your magic shall not save you. Actually, no, let's just do this. Yeah. Yeah, keep my damage on the board. Alright, there's that again. Get some more damage here. Victory Ooh, excellent. I'll hold back. I'm not sure if priests have AoEs that could ruin my day here. So be a little bit cautious. I mean, I've got plenty on the board right now. No need to overplay. I'll put it on your head. Again. My god. Alright, that thing's gonna get siphoned. I do not have lethal at the moment. Well, thank you. It's not over yet, though. Die, mage. Mm. I'll just life tap again. <laughs> Ragnaros. That'll end the game. <laughs> oh my god, a 16 health Ragnaros. Hit me in the face, hit me in the face, hit me in the face. That's okay. Alright, four, five, six... I don't think I have lethal. Four, five, six, seven. I don't have lethal. I do not have lethal. I could just leave that thing there. Well, you know what? Let's see if I can get lethal. 
Nope. Five, six, seven, eight. Hmm, I kind of want to use this deck against you. How goes it? Uh, not bad, I'm... What am... Am I 2-1? Well I don't quite remember. Are you ready for this? That was weird. Alright, is the music gonna come back? Can I please have my music back, game? You're not gonna bring the music back, are you? Alright, I'm gonna restart the game to get the music back because it's really strange without it, so I'll be right back. Alright, welcome back. The music has returned. Alright, 2-1. There's a pretty good chance I can get to three wins. Hopefully more. But as always, I will settle for three. Gul'dan versus Rom. For Doomhammer, your soul shall be mine. Eh, not the greatest. Flame Mip is good, the others, not so much. Yeah, Hellfire's more of a late game board clear. Nothing, okay. Shadow Bolt, just in time. Alternatively, I could Soul Fire and then Raid Leader. Nah. If only I could playing off that thing's shield. I could soul fire, hope my mortal coil doesn't go away, and then mortal coil it, but that seems kind of insane. So many possibilities. Maybe I'll just let it pop it. I'll just let them pop its shield on my flame imp and then just mortal coil it. Get some more early pressure, and I guess. I mean, no matter what they attack with, their Scarlet Crusader is just gonna die to Mortal Coil. That could be a problem. I 
I could smack that in the face and then mortal coil it. What's more important for them? Or what's more important for me? Getting rid of their damage potential or their card draw? I'm thinking card draw. If only I had the coin. I wish I had the coin right about now. Storm Pike Commando and Mortal Coil it. Ah. Hmm. Not sure if that was the best play. Yeah, yeah, you gotta be kidding me. That is an instant siphon soul. Instant Siphon Soul. That is the perfect target for Siphon Soul. Yeah, nothing else makes any sense whatsoever. Hit it very hard. And everything's dead. Oh. Do I Argent Commander that or the Beast it? I mean, I can't kill it with the Beast this turn, obviously. But. Hmm. The Beast! That thing is, well, a beast. Literally. And in more figurative terms, too. Hoping for a taunt? No taunt. Oh my god. Oh! oh. They were only able to do that because of the Master Swordsmith. I mean, the, uh, the Wrath of Air Totem. This bonus spell damage. Holy crap. Wow. Is that all you have? Oh my god, I feel so bad for you. That's all they have. Okay, do I have lethal? I think there's no way, right? Six, seven, eight. No, I can do eight damage. Every totem but a taunt. That is... that is depressing. Mm. Mm. 
Well, alrighty then. I still don't have lethal. Any big nasty taunt will be met with swift death thanks to the Black Knight. Such as that, for example. Alright, so I Black Knight that, I do that to that. Alright, GG. And there's another daily quest down. I think I have enough gold to do another arena run now. Yeah, 165. Cool. Alright, I've achieved three wins with this Bizarro deck. I faced a surprising amount of priests tonight. I wonder if that's just chance or if there's something, some reason for that. That is a terrible opening hand. What the hell? Wow. Greetings. I greet you. What? <laughs> Thanks. Out of all the cards I have, I don't have a single one, or didn't have a single one that cost two or below. Bye, Hellfire! Right, well, why don't you chew on my Torn Warrior? Have fun. I just realized that isn't even, isn't even gonna kill it. <laughs> and they can heal it back up. Hmm. Alright, so it wasn't the greatest of plays, I have to admit that. Shadow Bolt? Shadow that's not Shadow Bolt. <laughs> Venture Coach is instantly gonna get eaten by that. That'd be about the worst play imaginable. Bye, Black Knight. 
I'm just trying to control the board. Simply because I have such big stompy stuff. If I can just control the board for a while and get to the late game, I can be okay, I think. Oh my god. Oh wait, I can Siphon Soul next turn. Never mind, that's fine. Perfectly fine. I'm okay with that. Nothing else makes sense. No. Put a copy of a random card in your opponent's hand into your hand. You're not going to play one of my own cards, are you? I'm going to be so pissed if you do. What is that, a venture go? Did you get that from my hand? Or is that from yours? Hmm. Doesn't even matter. It's going to get shadow bolted. the beast, but I could also do this. Wait, what? What the fuck? Why is he 8-7? Oh, yeah, the raid leader. Okay, confuse me for a second. Change your mind. Ooh, got lucky with that one. Or did I? Take control of an enemy, enemy minion that has two or less attack. Never mind. It's the only thing it could have possibly worked on. Shields up. I hope I get a mortal coil. That is not a mortal coil. Mortal Coil? No. Hopefully not putting the taunt on my Frostal Forlord keeps it alive. Nope. It was worth a shot. Wait a minute, you get to keep that? The hell? You get to keep the damaged golem. Okay then. Interesting. That's 8 damage on the board. I wonder... Do 
Do I attempt to kill that and have it down to four? And then play nothing, or do I play the Venture Co. and try to soak up the damage? This gives me nothing on the board. I realized the Ventrico would have died to just two of their minions. Not such a good play. Well, shit. This is a nasty, nasty combo. They have 18 damage on the board. Actually, wait, there's nothing I can do to stop them. I have to do this. <laughs> is that going to make me live? Why do you go? Maybe? <laughs> Nearly certainly dead here. Yep, I'm dead. Three, three, the dream, as always. Will I continue my history of being always average? Probably. There's worse things to be than average, though, such as bad. Gul'dan versus Uther. I will fight with honor. Your soul shall be mine. Hmm. Soulfire this early. Should I keep it? Mm. I guess I'll keep it. Ah, <sighs> removal. I greet you. Lot of removal. You can even buff it up with demon fire. God, it seems like Hellfire always is the one that's removed from my hand when I'm discarding cards because of a... Because of a... Well... Battle Cry or a... Spell. Reporting for duty. I could turn you into a rather huge succubus. Let's do it. The succubus is gonna win me the game. What you want? Huh? You think that can stop me? That can't stop me. Is this succubus going to win me the game on turn five? I wonder.
I think this Succubus is actually going to win me the game on maybe turn 5. I have 10 damage in hand and on the board. Well, I probably won't win on turn 5. Unless I get something else. Ooh. Shit. What secrets do they have? I don't know what secrets they have. I know one of them is the one where you attack a different target. Hmm. So many possibilities. I think the succubus is gonna have to die. I wonder. I've got a huge gun. Does that secret trigger when you do that, or does it only trigger when you do this? Job's done. When an enemy, that's weird. So that doesn't count as an enemy attack. It actually has to be the, the minion going, moving towards them. Huh. You learn something new every day. How do I play here? This just to get killed? Seems dumb. I guess I'll just feed him something to kill. I mean, if I'm gonna feed him something, I might as well feed them something that costs... or something that's weaker than my Dark Iron Dwarf, I guess. I don't know. Oh, dear God. This isn't looking good. Hmm. Wait a minute. I just realized I have four. Da I have eight damage in hand. Do I kill their stuff or do I keep it and hope for what? What do I have that could do something? Hmm. Shut the fuck up, Jesus Christ. They could buff something that they have up to something horrible, but I don't think I'm gonna win this any other way. Should've done that first, and I should've played the Blood Imp before playing that. Not that it makes much of a difference. Okay, that's, uh, yeah. I'm dead. Pretty much my only hope at actually surviving is completely gone with that. I would need to get 10 more damage. Unless they leave what I have on the board. No. Well, alright, I do have a little bit of a breather.
probably just Siphon Soul. Well, double Blood Imp. Ah, get behind me. That's an instant Shadow Bolt. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Alright. They have the same health. They have a board disadvantage, but they have a significant card advantage. At least this turned back around in my favor. Kind of. Might be able to pull through this. Hmm. Alright, Siphon Soul needs to come out, absolutely. Right, so that's pretty much all of my removal gone. Actually, no, that's all of my removal and my hand gone. Doesn't leave me with too many options. Ooh, that's gonna kill my blood imp. Alright, I'm thinking I should control what they have on the board. I wonder. Not precisely the card I want here. I'm gonna keep the Black Knight in hand for something big and scary. Well, it's big and not exactly scary. Hmm. I could just silence it. I mean, it only does one damage. And <laughs> that's six damage on the board, though. I wonder. Or I could tap for... <sighs> what? What am I looking for? I'm not even sure.
so many possibilities. None shall pass. Your magic shall not save me. If they have a way to do three more damage, I'm done for. Engaging TC-130 mental dislocator. Out of all things you could have taken. <sighs> Alright, well. I'm still alive. Your magic shall not save you. Oh, I'm so dead. <laughs> I'm so, so dead. That's not going to save me. Well, Alright. Three wins with a bizarre deck that I've... In a class that I'm completely... Well, not completely. Almost completely unfamiliar with. I'm not disappointed. That actually wasn't too bad. Thirty gold and a card and a pack, I'll take it. Lava burst. All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed, and I will be back soon with more arena runs.